So in today's video, we'll be talking about that. So the question was, do you watch the students while they demonstrate? Uh, and the, the video is going to take a little bit of a tangent um, because I, I think we have to understand what it is that's in process, what's happening at that time, uh, to give you a to give you a greater uh, understanding of your mediumship and the way mediumship is taught. So if a student is demonstrating, I absolutely watch. Of course I watch. I want to be part of it. I, I, I love seeing demonstrating uh, mediums. It's just something I, I really enjoy. I like to see their process, you know, try and work out how uh, their sensory experience is unfolding for them uh, and, and then listen to their presentation. Um, and, and then I can offer uh, maybe a form of guidance through my experience and the uh, the relationship that I have with the spirit world. I can maybe give something to a student that is trying to learn demonstrating um, and trying to improve their relationship with the spirit world. Now, what the, the big misconception here is, and uh, that this will absolutely offend some people, um, is that uh, as a teacher, we cannot see what the student is seeing and already a few of you are getting ready to switch off or or disagree with me but let me tell you why the relationship that we have with the spirit world is unique uh, it's it's just me and my spirit world it's you and your spirit world and that process of the uh, uh, the blending of the minds it is unique the world over and the way that you decipher that information that the spirit world is giving you is solely down to you, completely. Your mechanics, your thought process, the neuro pathways that are within your mind are unique to you. And in this process, you are the instrument that is deciphering said information. There is no teacher in the world that can jump into your mind and understand your mind and see what you see or feel what you feel because you're the instrument. All the teacher can do is monitor the energy. Is it sticking? What's happening here? Now the teacher may go through a process where they decipher the energy through a clairvoyant way or through a, a clairsentient way, uh, whatever way. Uh, they'll decipher it in their way um, and, and the student will be working in their way. Maybe they're heavily clairvoyant or maybe they, they're heavily uh, clairsentient, but they'll be deciphering that information in that way. The one thing me or any other teacher can do is monitor the energy. Is it flowing freely? Is it uh, harmonious? Is the student, is the medium uh, uh, overthinking the process? Are they uh, getting stuck? What are they getting stuck on? Are they asking too many questions? Are they in their head too much? And at this point, the teacher will offer advice on what to do. Move it forward. Move that energy. What are you doing? How are you feeling that? How are you seeing that? What is the process that's going on there? but we will be aware of a problem, not, but not uh, experience the problem because the experience can only happen to the individual with their uniqueness and their relationship. There will be tons of you on this video that will go, well, that's wrong, Charlie, because I, I've worked with this name uh, and they told me I was doing this or I was doing that. And this is the purpose of the video. I'm telling you, they can't do that. I'm telling you, they, it's unique for the reasons that I've just gave you. Um, and, and the reason why teachers do this is to place themselves on said pedestal. So you return. I want to be that good. I want to uh, be uh, uh, that efficient uh, with my mediumship. And so it gives you a full sense of what is actually taking place or what is actually going on. A good teacher is going to let you make the mistakes, but then show you a potential uh, exit, a potential process, a potential mechanic to help you through uh, where the energy is sticking or if you're too much in your head, it's too much just you as the individual. Um, a good teacher is going to guide you in the right way. But I'm telling you, they cannot be on the exact same process as you. They can be on the link with you. Yes, that's that's absolutely correct. But they cannot interpret it the way that you do. Because you are unique. Your relationship is unique. They can only monitor the energy. So as you see, I got text there. Uh, uh, 
when you do your platform demonstration workshop, are you uh, are you going to watch every student work? Absolutely, of course I am. This is something that 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 has to take place. Uh, and there'll be some links that work wonderfully well and there'll be others that won't work wonderfully well. And in that process, we'll highlight the good and the bad. We'll get through the process of you as a platform demonstrator. Uh, and in that process, you will learn more about your relationship. You'll prob probably learn more about yourself and where you are sticking or where you are overthinking and getting too much in your own head. So yes, I watch the link. I, I go with the link. Uh, but I can't say, look over there, they're showing you this. I can't do that because that's that's taking place in my head, in my instrument, not in your instrument or in your mind or in your relationship. So I can do it as a suggestion, but it's not, it's not going to, there, there will be hit and miss on that uh, because it's down to suggestion then, isn't it? It's almost like, uh, have you looked at the car over there? Uh, and all of a sudden you'll see a car. How do I know that? Because of the process that I show you a million times on the videos also. Do not think of a white dog. Do not think of a red bull. And you can't help but do it. So it's just a, a, an insight into the teaching aspects when working with mediums, that they can't be on your link, they can't see what you see, they can't feel what you feel because you are unique. So I'm going to leave this uh, controversial subject here. Like it if you liked it. Subscribe if you aren't already. And I'll see you lot in the next video.